we have the rib, and we're also going to tell left and right where it is. We have the head, and we have the two line lengths on the head. So we have the articulating facets on the head, and these are the two that connect to the demi facets on the thoracic vertebra. So if I take two thoracic vertebrae, I would articulate it in between them, like so. So to articulate with these two demi facets. Demi facets make a full facet, and then it can articulate. After that, this right here in the middle of the two articulating facets is the crest on the head. So those are your three landmarks. If we move a little bit more laterally, we have the neck, which is in between the head and the cubicle on the rib. With the cubicle on the rib, there's two parts to it. There's the non-articulating part and the articulating part. The easier way to do it is the articulating part is the most smooth one, which would be this right here. It's also easier to tell because it's more medial. Okay, it's closer to the head, so this part would be the articulating part. This right here would be non-articulating. On a good rib, you would see that it's actually rougher than what is shown here. The articulating part, take these thoracic vertebrae again, it basically connects to that transverse process right there, the facet on the transverse process. Notice how there's a facet on there, and this facet right there. Notice how I said it was medial? That's where it is. Um, after that, we have the angle, which is basically right next to you're just going to see a nice sharper angle on, on a good rib. Uh, we have our body, which is just the whole rib itself. And then we move all the way back to the sternum. This will be the costal end. Okay, there's going to be cartilage here. And then we have our costal groove, which is on the inside, and it's inferior. And this is the telltale sign for a left or right rib. This costal groove right here, it's sharp, and it's kind of like a depression here. This is how to tell left from right. If it's inferior, you know that this is going to be a left rib.